What's up, everybody? How's it going? Got a good one for you. I got this 2025 Hyundai Tucson Limited. This is a big daddy, the top trim. The second two rest competition. Let's jump right into it. This one's not under $42,000. Now, if I show the exterior and all that good fun stuff, let me show the powertrain. This one is powered by a 2.5 liter non turbocharged full cylinder engine with GDI technology. Pumping out 187 horsepower and 176 pound feet of torque. Paired to eight speed automatic transmission, so it helps with reliability in the long term. Zero to 60, you spent 8.8 .8 seconds with top speed 118 miles an hour, going on regular grade gas. Shut it down, it's secure. Got four LED headlamps with stand across the board, daytime running lights. Also got a chrome finish on the grill. Because this is a limited model, we're gonna get the front parking sensors and the front facing camera. Also surround view monitor. Right below that, got a full LD fog lights on the bottom. Got the radiator right behind the grill. These are also functional on the bottom right here as well. Folds and hood, get a nice aggressive stance. Got a body cladding, which is unpainted. Got a 19 inch wheel setup. These are 275, 55, R19 in size on Kumo wrap tires. These are power folding with the LD turns and the indicators with the 360 cameras on the side. Got smart engine system, lock a lock the vehicle, mode engine start. I download the Hyundai digital app on your phone. So you use the phone as a key, but I think it's a very neat feature. Step to the rear. Got a full LED tail lights with your central light bar flows in really nicely from here to here, all across the tailgate. Got the rear parking sensors with the 360 cameras with the hands free lift gate as well. Got Tucson on the driver's side. Up top, got shop fin antenna with your rear spoiler, also with your LED backup lights here as well. That's the your fuel door, which is cap, not capless. Throw 87 regular in there. It's a winter sticker. It's a 2025 Tucson Limited front wheel drive. All wheel drive is an option. Our standard equipment. These are options on the side, on the bottom. Got $1,000 worth of options. Mate black. The mate gray paint color is $1,000. Got the floor mats for $210. Got the cargo net for $55. Got the cross rails for $349. Got a cargo tray for $120 and you got the first aid kit for $30. Get 25 city, 33 highway, that's standard across the board on every trim. 28 combined. Basically, this one is 38,545 down to 41,704. Take out the trunk space. Got accessories in the box. Got first aid kit, all with the floor mats. Got 12 volt outlet, 180 watts. Fold this down, get more room. Got a carpet mat. Spare tire with your jacks on the bottom. Fold this down, get a lot more space. You set your height if you're a shorter person. As you step inside, got power wins and locks, one touch up and down for all four, which is power for the mirror controls. Got eight-way power seats, which is lumbar support, lift up, slide, and recline. These are heated and ventilated, only available on the highest trims. Come with an upgraded both sound system. I believe it's 10 speakers. Got Tucson on the door seals. Soft to touch on the upper panel. Soft to touch on the middle panel. Hard touch for storage. Shut the door. Nice on the thump. The seat slot let up automatically when you enter the car and when you exit. Got a two-person memory up here as well. Got leather right steam wool. Got the steel mic controls. FM, AM, skip, and Sirius with the adaptive cruise control. Hang up and answer calls with the voice commands here as well. Got your favorites. Got your modes. Got push by start with standard across the board. Got two 12.3 inch displays. Which is standard on the high trim. Low trim is going to get the same setup, but it's going to be half analog and half digital. Got the Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. Got the 360 backup cameras. Also with your voice commands. You also got the highway driving assist. You also got the smart parking assist here as well with your remote entry. Got the fingerprint sensor. This camera for your face. Detect when you're falling asleep. Got dual zone car control. You also got the built-in navigation as well. The AC vents flows really nicely from here to here as well. 
This is for your storage. Soft to touch on the upper panel here as well. Got your auto dimming mirrors with the Home Link Universal Remote. Got interior lighting with your controls for your panel moon roof. Got the blue link. Also with the Hyundai Connected Services. You customize this in the middle. Down at the bottom, got your front parking brake. Got interior brightness. Got your lift gate controls with your traction control. Seal wall adjustments, which is manual. To a and wheel. You push this. This is not a hybrid or my hybrid. Got a triple startup noise. Standard being down here. The A speed control is on the steering wheel now. You can control the manual via pass shifters on the wheel. Got the drive modes, eco, normal, sport modes. Got the engine idle with the hill descent control with the parking sensors and 360 cameras. Got wide phone charging pad. Got cup holders. So a couple of butt lights, a couple of sodas, getting no drinking and driving. Got most storage cupboards on the bottom. With two USB port A's and C's with 12 volt outlet. Got storage in here, nice and damped. Got more storage, store a couple donuts in there as well. Now just step to the rear. Got AC vents back here as well. Two USB lightning ports, charge your phone. Got heated rear seats on both sides. Stretch my legs out, no issues. Check this out. My cup holders, store a couple water bottles, couple sodas in there. As you can see, it slides all the way back, vent in some air. Got side curtain air bags, keep it safe. On both sides here as well. Got interior lighting, which is LEDs. Both sides here. This one can see up to five, no issues. Give you a better look here. Fold these seats down, get more space. They fall all the way down, which I think is very nice. All right, everybody, that was 2025 Hyundai Tucson Limited. Leave your comments on the comment section below. Tell me what you think. Subscribe to my channel and leave your comments. I greatly appreciate that as well. And I would definitely see you in the next video, guys. Hit that subscribe button.